I know that um, we are pressed for time, and Alexander as well. In half an hour, he's meeting the president. But still, just in a nutshell, can you answer the question? Uh, now the uh, constituencies of the central federal territory exist within the unified legislative environment, yet some are successful in terms of bringing in investments while others are not. What are the reasons behind that? This is human factor or what? Lack of regional legislation on PPP or lack of guarantees to investors. What is it? Sergey, thank you very much. Uh, you know you are exactly right because various teams are there in the region, so depending on their competencies and proficiency, uh, a region does worse or better in terms of welcoming investments. Uh, by and large, the, if they are interested in enhancing living standards in the regions, but uh, they do not feature such comfortable environment as Moscow and other regions. They start from scratch and they do perform. Let's look at the Belgorod region. Uh, virtually, federal legislation uh, brings no preferences towards the Belgorod region, yet uh, still uh, looking at the last decade, uh, it uh, has become a locomotive of development, just as well as Kaluga region, uh, which used to have not a single act on the economic zones, but through its legislation and regulation, the team of the region succeeded in providing uh, a very favorable investment climate, which is attractive for investors. And Kaluga is another driver of investment developments. Uh, just through harmonization and alignment of its practices and legislation and providing better opportunities for business developments as such. Say the governor uh, allocates to a large, a large business owner or manager his private cell number. If you have any problems, he says, call me. And this is a very powerful instrument of disciplining the officials which are not performing to the bar. And there are also uh, inherent opportunities of any region, be it HR or scientific potential. I would agree with you that human factor is key. Uh, just as uh, a, a woman which is wonderful hostess can produce a feast out of nothing, uh, whereas uh, another one with less competency, having the best of foodstuffs, fails to do that. So um, this indeed happens to the regions as well. We need to be clear that development of uh, a business in a region is a two-way street. Uh, both the authorities have to make steps uh, in that area, and businesses have to be responsible. Looking uh, at Moscow across the board, there are very many speculative projects uh, in terms of buying and selling. This is not business. This is uh, should be about creating added value, and Moscow is coming to that. Moscow is capable of doing that. It has the resource of having a higher quality uh, prerequisites. It's a bit more difficult in the regions, but I would agree with Arkady uh, to say that more advanced regions with better teams do not ask anything from the federal powers. Looking at the federal legislation, we'd see that virtually all the necessary laws and acts are there, I would say, to the extent of 95 percent. What's left is to align uh, the federal and the regional level legislation, and then we will pave the road to that golden mean, uh, which is best for businesses and investors. And we should be absolutely clear at the regions, at all the entities and constituencies which are after business, that you should foster your business. It's like a tree. If you take care of the tree, it blooms and it brings fruit. The same goes for businesses. Uh, there shouldn't be any criminal prosecution or oppressing. Just 
put in place the right conditions. Thank you very much, and I also apologize to the forum's delegates. I have to rush for the next meeting, and I wish you every success at this venue, and I would like to support uh, the previously mentioned point that businessmen are active, are creative, and you will not threaten them by whatever difficulties. Thank you.